Louisiana Beer Reviews, Sweetwater's Exodus, Jamaican Coffee Porter, made not in Jamaica, but in Atlanta, Georgia, with coffee from Java Nina, I think it's called. Uh, look like most of their coffee comes from Nicaragua, but anyway, um, I bought this at Mathern's, was not expensive, 6.6% .6 alcohol, zero IBUs, they're saying. Okay, Jamaican Coffee Porter, product of the USA. They had to put a disclaimer there because it's not from Jamaica. Two row, okay, this apparently came out in 2002. They used two row barley malt, Munich chocolate and caramel malts. The hops are Centennial Goldings and Willamette. Beer advocates saying it's very good as they call it 75 out of 100. Untapped also gives it a 75 out of 100 and Rape Beer is 10, per, 10 points higher, 85 out of 100 and 85 out of 100 in the style. I've never had it before. Might have been out since 2002 but we've had it here since 2019. <laughs> All right. Uh, might have been late 2018 when we got it. I will see if there are other video reviews for it. If it's been on the market that long, I would expect there'd be a good number of them. This is sold in cans, which is what we get, bottles, and on draft. All right. Hmm. Lively. Okay, a thick beige head and the appearance, it's pretty bright sunlight out there here at 8.30 a.m., is dark brown, nearly black, really. Um, I do see, now with the light hitting it, I see some ruby shining through. You'll get that from time to time with these very dark brown, not truly black porters and stouts. The aroma's coffee, dark malt like dark brown bread crust, uh, some creaminess in there like coffee and cream. All right, it's looking good so far, it's smelling pretty good. Let's go with the taste. Yeah. All those elements. Now it does have some acrid bitterness, like, a, like these dark roasted Beers will be sometimes, it's almost like a cigarette ash, ashes, cigarette ashes, which tends to be associated with these kind of drinks. It may not appeal to you. I don't love it. And I've often described them as, you know, you've heard me say, oh, it tastes burnt, it tastes burnt. Well, yeah, I kind of like that. Like I say, cigarette ashes. Um... So definitely getting a, a burnt thing here a little bit. Um, black coffee cream, medium mouthfeel, not too light in the mouth. It's almost into the stout territory. Semi-sweet finish. Well, uh, oh, oh. Hmm. How would I score this? Decent lacing here, as you can see. Well, it's pretty carbonated. All right. I like it. I think it's flavorful. It's good. It has a, some little downsides to it, but I think I will go with an 88 out of 100, a B plus. So 88 out of 100, a B plus, a very good beer from Sweetwater, who does, to me, a lot of good things. Um, some of the things I didn't like, but mostly I have enjoyed them. So Laissez Les Bon Temps Relay. A very good, almost stout porter, and I'm going to end this review by saying, y'all come on down to southeastern Louisiana. <laughs>